Here, guys, I'm going to get everything set up. <clears throat> just having the news and the weather real fast for you. And we'll get Anna Kayla on in just a few seconds. I'm meteorologist Derek Green with your live Super Doppler 7 forecast. Smoky AC skies in the area this morning. Should thin out a bit this afternoon with a mostly sunny sky and a southwesterly breeze 10 to 15. We've got Albuquerque's high at 90 degrees, South at 83. Mostly clear this evening and mostly clear through the earth. Hopefully, I got it going here. <laughs> We're trying to get it all set up. Okay, Anna Kayla, so after this song, then we'll come in live and we'll start going for it. <laughs> okay. I also got you live on uh, Facebook Live on my page. Hopefully it's on the station page as well. So uh, they'll be seeing a screen of, of yourself and uh, your little promotion there. Okay, thank you. Good morning to everyone tuned in. We're getting everything going there. I'm going to check this again, guys. Getting votes already, guys. Uh, it was uh, Miss Chevelle Shepard's birthday yesterday. I don't know why it's not um, sharing my video, but we're going to get it shared now. getting calls as we are speaking good morning to everyone tuned in trying to get my uh video going here so we'll see if this goes <laughs> great song by anna kayla this is one of her first hits good morning to big lou Good morning to Richard. It is smoky out there, guys. Stay safe. I'm going to go back to the... You guys can hear everything there. Remember to check out her, uh, check out Killing Me Softly with her, with Anna Kayla. Um, that's going to be the, going to the Native American Relief Fund, a donation. So check it out, guys. I got the link here. Uh, make sure to check it out. Seconds and we'll be live. You guys get to see the behind the scenes here. <laughs> Good morning, everyone. I will upload this video to YouTube, Tumbian, so we'll get that going. Oh yeah, that was Musica de Ana Kayla Trujillo right here on King New Mexico, 11.50 a.m., 102.1 FM, the best mix of New Mexico music. A little bit of dulce recuerdos. It is 10.06, it's Friday, June the 19th, and guess what? We do have our featured artist of the week live on the phone line. We do have Ana Kayla. She called in uh, this morning, and we're talking to her about a few things. Good morning, Ana Kayla. How's it going? Good morning. It's going great. Well, that's always good to hear. I hope you didn't have to get up too early for the interview. Luckily, it's not too, too early. 
Yes. Well, you know what was great? I got to get online last night to uh, Instagram, and I got to see yourself performing uh, with your friends last night. Can you tell us a little bit about that performance? It was really great. Yes, yeah, so last night um, we did a little concert with my friends, um, Michaela Antonia and Sarai Elise. And um, Michaela actually texted us one day and um, asked us to do a concert, and a few days later we were practicing, and um, we worked really hard on it. And we even did some improv a little bit. And it was just really fun. And it was great to bring um, joy to the people. Um, and we just had a really great time. Well, it was awesome, let me tell you. I really enjoyed it, um, seeing you three singing together. Uh, you did everything. You even did a little bit of Dixie Chicks I saw there. So that's really cool. I, 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 I like that a lot. Thank you. And it's great because we get along really well. Like, from the beginning, um, We've just been having a lot of fun together, and we've gotten really close, so, yeah. That's great. Are, are you guys all at the same class in Taos there? Um, I think we're all in different grades, but um, we're, we've known each other for a long time, so it would be neat to connect with them. That's always good, especially when you know each other, uh, and you're all singers, all very talented, so that's what's great, and uh, continuing the music for generations, is which is awesome for sure. Yeah, and thank you for supporting, as always. Well, you are very welcome. I appreciate you guys. Um, I play the music, but you guys make it, so that's what's always great. So I love to support everyone there. And so uh, you have a brand new single out. We've been playing it here uh, at KW Mexico. It's been doing very well. It is the uh, Killing Me Softly with his song, the bilingual version. And uh, you are doing something really cool about that. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about that? Yeah, so um, I actually released it to the radio stations around Christmas time, I believe, but um, we had a little bit of trouble with the licensing, but we finally got it, and um, just like a few weeks ago, and I guess that was the perfect time for us to get the licensing, because I was able to, to do something special with it, especially now during this time, and um, as being native, um, I feel for all these communities and want to help them right now, this cause is very close to my heart and I think it's very important to inform people because not everyone knows about um, how Native communities are kind of in a state of emergency right now and how COVID-19 has affected them and um, I feel like I have to inform people about it so we can support them through this tough time, you know, to bring food, water and other emergency supplies to um, some of the hardest hit families um, and communities that are impacted by COVID and um, so yeah, so all the proceeds from my new song that's on um, most music streaming platforms. Um, Kill Me Softly will be um, donated to the Native American Relief Fund through July 1st. So I'm trying to challenge, you know, all of my listeners and fans to um, download and stream the song as much as possible. Um, I think next week on the, yeah, on the, two weeks, a little over two weeks that we have left to um, raise money for this. And also um, you can donate on my GoFundMe, which you can find on my Facebook or my Instagram. Well, that is great. You know what? I really, when I saw that you were doing this, this is great because I have many Native American uh, friends from the Navajo Reservation and, you know, it's been hitting them very hard. So I just really appreciate this. And I have been streaming this for sure. Let me tell you, I've been streaming it a lot. It's great. I, I use Spotify a lot. So that's the best way to do it. Yeah, thank you so much again. And if anyone wants to learn more about the cause, um, they can go to www.nmcf.org slash program slash native slash. Perfect. Well, I do have uh, the picture there, uh, your promotional there. So if they want to see it more on Facebook, I got it shared too. Check out Anna Kayla's page. Again, that has everything uh, you need to see there to help out and to, uh, I like the challenge. I like that. Maybe we'll challenge everybody to keep, keep, keep downloading. Uh, I did want to ask, how was Anda School for you? I know it's been kind of crazy, but uh, something not with uh, music. How was it for you guys? Um, it was kind of difficult. Um, you know, trying to stay motivated was really hard because um, there's obviously um, a lot of things going through um, that kids are going through. It's hard for us to kind of swallow everything that's going on. And focusing on school is kind of hard, but um, I got through it and I kept myself busy with, you know, the live concerts and everything. I feel like that helped me um, get through school. And, um, yeah, but our teachers were very helpful. I'm so grateful to them. They've definitely worked hard to keep us engaged and help us get through the rest of the school year. 
Well, that's good. I, you know, I wanted to talk about those live videos too because uh, I'm glad that you said they helped out. I think they helped out a lot of people keeping them uh, with music, you know, and, and you did every Friday night, I believe. Are you going to keep doing that again? Yeah, hopefully soon I'll be able to get that going again. I just got a little busy there. Um, you need to take a little bit of a break. But, um, yeah, definitely I've been missing them, so I'll definitely have to get back on. No, that would be great for sure. And I know it's a lot of work, and it's kind of nerve-wracking, too, being in front of the camera there, and, and, and no one, you know, you don't see anybody, really, so that's what's hard. It's kind of awkward. <laughs> It is awkward. Whenever I do the live videos here at the station, I'm, I'm always like, well, I don't know if it works, but it works, right? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, tell everyone, give me a minute, I need to get all the nerves out. <laughs> I think that's the best thing to do. Yeah, you got to take a little bit of time and get ready for sure. Yeah. I did want to ask, uh, who are your inspirations? I wanted to ask, uh, who got you into singing and who you look up to? You know, I definitely... Um more than, um, I guess I'm like a lyrical person. I get connected to the lyrics a lot, and I think the people who have inspired me most um, musically are probably um, Aretha Franklin and um, Alicia Keys, um, a lot of soulful artists like that, um, Stevie Wonder and all them, just because um, I can feel that emotion. You know, you can feel the pain and you know what they're going through, and, I, and it's almost helped me you know, get through some things, and that's kind of my goal in my music career, is to help people get through um, whatever they're going through and um, help them relate and feel better about whatever. Well, that is really good, and those are great artists, you know, to, uh, to have for inspirations, you know, I definitely think, uh, I know you did a live video covering a Lisa Keys song, are you thinking about recording any of those? You know, maybe I, um, you know, put my own spin on it, kind of, um, my style, and maybe make it into something pretty cool. I think that'd be great because this Killing Me Softly with his song, you really hit, got a great spin on it. Uh, I like the Fuji's uh, version, of course, and this one really came out awesome. Thank you. Were you able to work, uh, you worked with Darren Cordova on this one, correct? Yes, I did. And uh, are you still recording with uh, Darren and them, or are you, uh, do you have any secrets you can let go, or are you still uh, working on any new music? Um, I can tell you that I'm working on three songs right now. Um, they're in the works. I haven't recorded them yet, but I know um, we're getting there. And um, they're really exciting songs, and I'm really excited to put, um, you know, my style on it. And he really um, understands, you know, um, I don't know how to explain it, but um, just that, because, um, you know, he has his own style, but he really right. takes into account what I like in my style, and he puts that into my music. and. Um, I'm just really grateful for that. That is awesome, because I did talk to uh, Mr. Cordova there, Darren, uh, a couple months back, I think during the awards, and we were talking about it, and I told him he really does a great job with you guys, and he does let your individuality come out in the song, so I really like that. Mm -hmm. I, I think it's just great to keep the, that individuality going, and I know you guys share it, uh, especially with your the group that, I guess you're starting that group, right, after last night. Yeah, hopefully we can um, maybe record. I don't know. They were <laughs> talking about it last night, yeah. Well, that's great. And did you guys come up with a name? I know I heard something at the beginning, but I don't know if you had a name for you three uh, three girls there. Yes, yeah, the Ray's mom actually um, gave us a name called um, Las Aldas, which is basically the fearless, which I think is really cool. Yeah, that's awesome. Nice. I like that. I think that's great. I, I think that's perfect for you three ladies there getting a gun uh, live is hard like we said earlier about the nerves and everything and I know Saray has been doing a few live videos too so that's pretty cool I'm glad that you guys are doing that yeah and um, I think right now um, well anytime I guess it's really important to support other artists and grow with each other especially because mm -hmm. around the same age and we're just kind of starting out I feel um, very grateful and honored that um, they're alongside me during my musical journey and I can be alongside them um, theirs and I'm just really grateful that I have friends that are always going to support me. Well that is great and you know we do have to support each other especially during this time and with your uh, latest uh, single you're going to be having it uh, donations go to the Native American Relief Fund as we talked about earlier. Remember guys you can check out nmfc.org slash programs slash natives. A native excuse me that's nmfc.org slash programs slash native and we do have that link up on our Facebook page right now with the live all proceeds from and downloads and streams until July 1st will be donated 
to the Native American, really fun. That's Killing Me Softly with his song. That's by Anna Kayla. So it's going to be great. If you're on your streaming pro platforms, you got Apple Music, Spotify, Google Music, uh, I think even Amazon Music, which I haven't checked out, but all those, even YouTube, you can check those out and the donations will go to the Native American Relief Fund. So let's get those uh, those downloads and streaming going, right? Yes, for sure. And um, thank you to everyone who has already um, supported this so much. I'm very grateful to everyone who has donated and streamed and downloaded and keep going. Well, that is awesome, Anna Kayla. Well, you know what? I'm going to play your latest song here, and I won't keep you too long because I know you are busy with everything going on, but I appreciate you calling in for this interview and supporting it. We'll keep pushing this for sure, and uh, we're looking forward to those new songs too here. Yeah, and thank you so much for having me and for all the support. Thank you again. Right now it is Killing Me Softly with his song. It's Anna Kayla Trujillo. Remember to keep downloading and streaming it online and requested it here at the station también here on Key New Mexico. We thank Anna Kayla Trujillo for calling in this morning. We appreciate it and have a great day, guys. Right now it's Anna Kayla Trujillo, Killing Me Softly with his song. Thank you, Anna Kayla. Have a great day. You too. Thank you so much, Jen. Keep, uh, keep up all the great work, too. All right. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Hope everyone was able to tune in, guys. We're going to let you hear this song. And uh, great to have Anna Kayla call in. <clears throat> I'll let you hear this, and I will be back, guys. Two times. Hey guys. Remember to keep donating. Download. It's easy, guys. You can just download. Um, the song and stream it and you're donating that's awesome right let's keep doing it guys
Great song there by Anna Kayla. Remember, keep streaming and you can download Tambien and you'll send it to uh, all the proceeds from July 1st. We'll go to the Native American Relief Fund. Thanks again to Anna Kayla Trujillo for calling in. We appreciate all these young artists keeping New Mexico music going. Thank you guys. Have a great weekend.